and sacred test experiments for so, uh, first question is ahmed investigates shadow using a stick here instead of a stick i'm using a pencil and instead of the sun i'm using a torchlight when i get the torchlight over here the shadow forms over here so which means this is the place where the sun is supposed to be when i keep it over here the shadow forms over here keep it over here the shadow forms over here and when i keep it over here the shadow forms over here the uh, equipment um, ahmed uses to measure the length is a, a measuring tape the shadow makes uh, the stick makes a shadow because the light is blocked by the object the deep part of the first question is ahmed says i think the shadow will be longer when the sun is low in the sky and circle the type of statement he makes the options are answer observation prediction and question when we use the word think it means prediction ahmed notices the shadow moves during the day he asks his friends why the shadow moves circle the friend with the correct answer this friend says you are moving the stick this friend says you are making the stick shorter this friend says the light is closer to the stick this friend says the light is coming from a different direction because the light is coming from a different direction that is why the shadows change moves the second question is Frida is investigating how light passes through different materials. So the glass in the bathroom window lets light through, but we cannot see it because it is translucent. The others outside do should not see what's going on inside. The normal window, the glass in the normal window is transparent because so then we can see outside. Mic is in a dark room. Is third question is the mic is in a dark room. He puts a puppet between a light source and a screen like this. Puppet, light source, and the screen. A light travels from the light source, and light is blocked by the puppet. That a dark area appears on the screen. The dark area name is shadow. I will show this how it happens in my experiment. I am using a torch light for the light source. When I keep the puppet over here. See, it forms a shadow because it's an opaque object. The shadow will be smallest when it's closest to the screen. The shadow will be biggest when it's biggest, uh, closer to the light source or furthest from the screen. And it will be at a mid edge when it's uh, the main point of the screen. So, um, opaque means it lets no light through. It's like a shadow puppet. Translucent means it lets some light through. Uh, opaque lets no light through and it forms the darkest shadow. Translucent lets some light through and also forms a shadow but it uh, forms a little greyish. Transparent lets some uh, no light, um, all the light through. So it like this. So the light fully passes through, no shadow forms. This is a light ray, this one, and that is a reflected day, the one you see. It bounces on the mirror and it reflects. Thank you.